and crooks stealing pocket change, leaving expensive items behind during their break-ins. It's a rash of crimes targeting car owners in Mira Mesa. The Tenders reporter Jessica Chen has the surveillance video and why police say the thieves are so hard to catch. Seems like um, they're looking for things that are quick and easy to grab. They're not traceable. Chris Taylor says he knows this because this is his white car being broken into. Watching these two people sift through his car in Mira Mesa, it was only change and a car charger they were after. I had credit cards in plain view um, once you opened up the console. But they didn't want that or any expensive valuables in the car. And it's something thieves in Mira Mesa have been targeting again and again. Janet Kim, who also lives in the area, says it has happened to her too. They took uh, some coins that totaled about $5. They left all of my camera lighting equipment in the car. Didn't touch some of my electronics. The thieves even had time to sort through her change, singling out the foreign currency. It seems like a lot of work to go through to get some coins and some change. And this string of crimes has been happening between 1 and 3 in the morning. But it's unclear if it's the same people breaking into unlocked cars. It's really frustrating to, to have somebody just rifle through your stuff and invade your privacy. Police say it's tough to say if this is a trend because many people don't report petty crime. But Taylor says it happened to him and his neighbors more than once. I don't know whether it's random, but uh, they're definitely patrolling around every so often. In Mira Mesa, Jessica Chen, 10 News.